Hey, what is going on, guys? Filthy Bird here, back with another episode of WWE Supercard Season 2. Um, so, PCC was announced literally right after I recorded the video last night. Um, it is going to be Xavier Woods vs. Retro Chris Jericho. Um, now, my prediction on who's going to win, I think Chris Jericho is actually going to win. Um, just because it's kind of a like retro card, but the funny thing is, this Xavier Woods will make a pro, um, not a pro, this Xavier Woods will make a tag for people who have uh, a lot of the event cards. So that's interesting. Um, but the survivors are Dolph Ziggler and Kofi Kingston. Uh, I would love to get that Dolph Ziggler card. Um, and then the legendaries are no pros for me. They're Booker T and Dean Embers. I already have a pro Booker, and I really don't want another one, to be honest with you. And then uh, Dean Ambrose, which I wouldn't mind having that card just to have for the picture. Um, and then the epic cards are Rusev and Bray Wyatt. I've already had, uh, pretty sure I've already had a Bray Wyatt. Um, I've never had a Rusev. So that's interesting. Um, so yeah, I'm probably going to go for the legendary card. Um, may grind a little bit harder. To get something else, but uh, the ultimate goal is probably just gonna be the legendary card. You know, um, I don't have a lot of time during the week and in, and and in the weekend, I like to spend time with my family a lot of the time. So I just don't sit on my phone the whole time. They're not knocking on anyone who does. It's just I have other priorities um, at this point in life, really. <laughs> Um, so we're doing a little bit of progress on Brian. I haven't really played, to be honest with you today. Um, my King of the Rings is still going good for the amount of times that I've energized. I've barely energized, um, but it is time to energize here very, very soon. Um, so I'm surprised I beat this Tommy guy, too. Looks like the only two times I lost was because of Divas, but, you know, he has epic pros. Um, so I should have no problem reaching semis in this King of the Rings. And uh, I will make a decision, because uh, I work tomorrow, and uh, I'll make a decision later on, looking at the brackets, if I want to uh, spend credits, um, if I can guarantee myself a win. I don't want to spend credits to end up losing in the finals like I did last time. It's kind of like a gut uh, feeling, kind of sucks. I'm excited about PCC tomorrow, it's a little bit better, you can get out games way quicker than RTG and Ring Domination. The other thing that sucks is you got to keep on playing or you lose your rank. <laughs> so we'll see how that goes. It might be a little bit of a chill PCC, but it might not be. Um, so who knows? This is fun though. So uh, by the time you guys probably see this, you guys, uh, if you guys are watching this on PCC day, let me know how you guys are doing in PCC. I mean, it starts at three in the a three a.m. for me, so I'm, <laughs> I'm not gonna be able to. Um, not gonna be able to play at the start. Usually, I put a couple games down in the morning, and then uh, I do a little bit at lunch, and then I play a couple games here and there um, on break. But tomorrow's kind of like a longer day at work. Today we actually got out short. Uh, we only worked like ten hours, so today would have been a good day for PCC to be out. But it's always the worst time for stuff to happen. Uh, let's see, let's my... So yeah, we're 300 games away from that uh, 9k ladder reward. I'm trying not to play that much. But, I don't know, it's, it kind of sucks. Um, being so close, I'm pretty sure I need a King of the Ring win. I need a King of the Ring to win this King of the Ring. That way I can get a higher chance of getting the D.Va. Um, I mean, I'm 300 games away. By the time uh, the next King of the Ring would end, it would be on a Sunday. And 300 games in between now and Sunday. Uh, with PCC this weekend, that's going to be very easy to get. So, um, yeah, this came to, this King of the Ring um, for tomorrow, it has to be something good. Let's hope. I'm hoping tomorrow's not too long of a day at work, because sometimes I get antsy, honestly, um, on claiming my King of the Ring results. Sometimes I get really, really antsy. Like, I'd say sometimes the King of the Ring will end at, like, 3, 
3 in the afternoon. Um, and I'll be at work ready to claim it. Wanting to claim it so bad. And then sometimes I won't get off for like another 7 hours. That's a whole 7 hours I'm waiting every time I click on Supercard seeing King of the Ring finished. Um, and just thinking in the back of my mind, oh wait, this could be a pro. I really don't have want to have to wait. I don't have the much patience for things like that. When I want something, I usually want it now. So we'll see how that King of the Ring goes tomorrow. It's got to stay positive. You know, if we don't reach Survivor tier by the time that 9k ladder reward is up, it is what it is. Um, just got to keep on grinding to get other stuff, I guess. So I'm hoping we get a double stat match up here. My goal is maybe to have Brian um, probed by the end of the night. That would be really sweet if I could get that to happen. But we'll just see how it goes. I really need another left arrow legendary pro. That way I can have a legendary pro tag. Because with the way I could have things right now, I'll show you guys real quick. I could have a legendary pro tag. Um, because I have another legendary pro that's not even in my King of the Ring deck. And that's shame is who's really bad. Um, what I couldn't end up doing is, let's say for example, I can put Brock in here. Now I got a legendary pro tag. And then I could put Seamus right here with Finn Valorant. Um, but Seamus will lose a lot of matchups against other cards. Whereas Rock, Rock will win a lot of singles matchups. So it's kind of like a double-edged sword. I don't, I, I can't tell you. I have to leave Rock in a single spot. It's just because he's one of the best legendary pro cards. It's just basic strategy for me, really. Because <clears throat> in King of the Ring, I don't really face a lot of Legendary Pro tags. Um, a lot of people I face will have a Legendary Pro and an Epic Pro, or um, people will have stuff like I have right now is um, they'll have a Legendary Pro and then a Survivor single as uh, their tag team. Yeah, I had a little bit of a brain foot there. So we'll take that one. We could have had a two stat matchup for Daniel Bryan, but sometimes I just like to take the win. Hmm. Excited to get Daniel Bryan program. Excited to see what his stats will be. Should be something good. Um, just improve the RTG deck, really. So that's reassuring to know. Alrighty. So how's your guys' gay? How was your day, guys' day today? Mine was decent. It was a little bit of a shorter day at work. Um, I didn't have the best day at work, to be honest with you. I just there's a lot of drama and bull crap at work, and uh, yeah, I don't like I don't like dealing with idiots at work. I have a very bad temper when it comes to them kinds of things. Usually, I'm the nice, the nicest guy in the world, but when I have to deal with an idiot, I get a little pissed off. So we'll take the victory again. I think it's time to change that summer picture, that summer rate picture. I think it's time. Let's look through our cards and see if we can find anything good. Let's look through our epic cards, actually. I really like that epic uh, Dolph Ziggler picture, though, too. Hmm. Let's see here. Maybe... Maybe you're in, maybe? Um, hmm. So yeah, so Bray Wyatt will be a pro for us. That'd be cool. That'd be cool to get him and then pro him up to complete something for the card catalog. Um, shoot, we use this. We use this Ryback picture. Something cool. Oh my. So no one's really talked in King of the Ring chat either. It's been a pretty quiet King of the Ring. I know some, uh, there's a viewer, someone who watches my videos is in the King of the Ring, so it's always cool to be recognized. Um, yeah, it's really hard to pronounce his username in the game. It's, whoa, what the world am I doing? It's a lot of letters. Just a bunch of random letters. And I'm sorry if it means something, but I don't know, I can't really pronounce it. There we go, we lose that one, unfortunately. And thank God that freaking Jack Swagger did not rock on us. Toughness speed, we got enough support for that, but 
We only have one epic per V though. Which sucks. We'll take it though. Alrighty. See, I'm we'll probably play for the board we sent. Hopefully, we get something good. Um, so yeah, still got 28 10 credits left. I haven't spent any. Um, like I told you guys a while back, I really want to. I wish I had more time to get better content out for you guys. When I say better, I'm not talking about improving the quality of these videos. Because I really like the quality of these videos, but. Um, I really want to get more WWE 2K16 videos out. That's really something that I really want to get out. Um, I have a bunch of ideas. I've been jotting ideas down for videos. Um, the first priority is, like I promised you guys a while ago, I really want to get that Shield vs. NWO matchup uh, video out. And I'm probably going to have to do it on a weekend just because that's when I have enough time to edit the video and everything. Um, but the thing, the reason why it hasn't been up yet, sure I already told you guys though, but I literally, the match was a pretty long match. And I didn't want the match to be a long match, it's just a, the way it went because I wanted to do uh, an elimination tag match. And what happened was, um, the match came, the ending was insane to the match. Um, like the match kind of told a story in its own and I really liked that. Um, so I was going to edit the video to where it only shows like the last couple minutes because I didn't want to make too long of a video. You know, it gets boring after a while. Um, so I was just going to edit it out to the good parts. Um, and literally, I went, to the, I went to edit the video and I lost all the footage out of nowhere when I went to render the video. Um, it doesn't show up in my computer at all. Um, so it's kind of like a night... Ugh like a sucker punch in the gut. I put in all that work. I probably put in like two hours. Um, probably like a half hour recording the video and then like an hour and a half editing the video. This is kind of like a sucker punch. So I was like, uh, I was a little pissed off. So I just, I didn't do anything on Sunday because I recorded it Saturday night. Uh, so I'll probably get it out to you guys this weekend. Hopefully, I won't make no promises. Just depends on what I want to get into. Alrighty, so we lost against that evil. We're facing a lot of Epic Pro Divas today. Usually we don't face this many. Alrighty. Uh, alrighty, sweet. We won that by 12 points. I'll take that. Alrighty. So let's take that PCC hype tomorrow. While I'm drinking Mountain Dew. Yo. Let's get some King of the Ring hype results hype for tomorrow. I'm so ready to get this King of the Ring over with. It gets, it's like there's gonna be a huge sigh of relief when I actually do get that legendary preview. Like it's gonna be a huge weight off my shoulders. Because I've been pushing the brink of legendary tier for like a month now. Maybe not a month exactly, but it's it's definitely due. It's gonna be so nice to get there. The payout is going to be so much sweeter, too, which is what I keep telling myself. Jesus, that Brock Lesnar's speed was 15.55. What the hell? He had no enhancements, either. Jesus. That was insane. It would have beat my Seth Rollins without that Brock. Right. Oh, Eric Rowan getting closer to that reset. Will it be that legendary pro diva? You're not that lucky. Alrighty. Hey, almost 8 o'clock my time. It's getting late. It's getting late. I'm so excited to move into a new place. My, me and my, uh, me and Sabrina have been looking at more and more places. And the area is kind of dry for houses for rent. Um, and every time we get our hopes up for one, it seems like there's always someone that not much quicker putting in the application to get it for us. Um, so it's like kind of a long process, and it's getting very frustrating. Cause we get our hopes up, especially her. Uh, I hate her seeing. I hate getting my hopes up and her hopes up, event, especially seeing a nice place and not actually getting it. That really sucks. But we'll find something. I don't try to stress over it too much, but then again, I do stress. Whatever it is, I want to get 
a really nice place. With a good neighborhood, of course. We looked at one last night that is available, but it had a really shitty neighborhood. And I don't want that. I don't want to have. I don't want my daughter to be playing outside, and be worrying about uh, her playing outside, thinking whether well, there's a drug dealer a couple feet away or something like that. It's something crazy. It's just parent instinct that kicks in. All of you guys that are parents, I'm sure you guys definitely feel the same. So, all right, he will win that one because gold dust power sucks. Alrighty. Let's get that out. Charisma. Yep, no reset still. I wish Hideo Tommy had more cards passed on Tommen too. I think he has a common and uncommon. Then the real question is why the hell does Big E Langston? Or Big E. Uh, why does he only have a rare card? I don't understand that. The guy is a beast. He is golden in New Day. In New Day he is hilarious, especially with his twerk and shit. Some hilarious stuff. Yeah, there we go. It's power sucks. Uh, power. We might as well go for the three oh, victory, and we're gonna get it because we're compatible in there or not. Plus, we got the negative forty-five uh, table enhancement there for power. All right, let's get this reset, uh, baby. Let's go. All right, let's do this one. Oh, we got three picks too. I forgot. There we go, Rare John Cena, which I actually like that picture a lot. All right, you guys, that is. That's probably going to be it for today's video. Nice little, uh, how long is this video? Nice little 17 or so minutes grind video for you all. Um, thank you guys all for watching. Really appreciate the continued support on the videos. Daniel Bryan's about ready to be pro. But um, guys, that's probably going to wrap up today's video. Guys, thank you all for watching. Don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe. Guys, it really helps me a lot. Uh, but I'm for the bro, guys. I will see you all later.